doing a couple of videos like I said if you want to see the video I just did I may or may not upload them oops, <laughs> at the same time or in consecutive order then just go and check in the playlist that I have hopefully right on the my main page and then you'll see like natural hair I'll have all those videos over there okay so you can go and check out the different products and things that I talk about so this one is about the Karen's Body Beautiful sweet ambrosia leave-in conditioner now this as I said in the last video along with this are like my holy grail items right now they are going to be staples in my I have a crazy mosquito bite on my knee that's why I'm itching like that sorry I don't have like problems but I have crazy mosquito bites today and I didn't even go outside like that I don't know what's going on but these two items or this line you know this is really something I'm gonna really you know invest in because my hair seems to love it something serious now this leave-in is not really like a lot of other neat leave-ins especially because there's some other leave-ins that I have which I had the um Alake Naturals or I have it the Alake Naturals um lemongrass leave-in you know a lot of people are they they love it you know but I'll, I'll do another video about that because you know that's a whole other video itself but this here my hair seems to love a lot this is a um, it's called the sweet ambrosia leave-in conditioner I don't know if I said that I have it in the cranberry cocktail I mentioned it in my favorites video and in my hair haul video I think but this I really wanted to say like put my actual review the, the actual review for it now it says on it that you're only a few dabs away from lush radiant soft hair um, and then also that dry super thick hair needs this best-selling leave-in conditioner and they say the directions say to apply a generous amount to hair when damp or dry to refresh and moisturize and you can use this several times a week or daily and you can use it before applying heat okay now I used it both before applying heat and also just as like a um, when doing twists or doing Bantu knot outs or doing what else a lot of different things even just washing it and putting it in and kind of just doing somewhat of a wash and go and, and then layered it kind of with the hold it gel it still worked out my hair seems to love this stuff I don't know what it is about it it's pretty simple as far as the ingredients even though it has like this big paragraph but I mean as far as it's all things that are not like crazy it's purified water jojoba avocado and coconut oils vegetable wax panthenol arnica um, do I really have to say all of this basically it's a lot of more natural based things and even though it is a little bit more pricey I'm on her Karen's actual website and it says it's $12 I bought it at an event if you hadn't seen that other video before then you wouldn't see when you know the whole uh, how I got it but I actually met her at an event and then I bought two three items for the price of two my hair is has this tendency to um, just not love <laughs> you know a lot of different types of leave-ins like I used to use you know forever the Carol's Daughter Tui T-U-I um, leave-in conditioner or the, um, the black vanilla one I think that's what it's called but this has replaced all of them my hair when I put this in automatically you can see a difference and that hydrated look that it has it stays for days at a time you know sometimes I may have to refresh my hair with some water or something like that but this here has my hair staying really really nice there's one other leave-in conditioner that I used recently that is at a lower price point but it's still pretty good I use it a couple of times and it has a different effect on my hair but if I can't get this I would use that and maybe I'll use that other one and I'll mention it later <laughs> um if I don't want to use this up because this one costs more this one is really good for um, you know just when you need a leave-in conditioner after you wash or if you're going to do some heat styling or something like that I'm not saying that this has heat protectant in it but this here is worth the money it has a great 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 smell it looks like that almost like um like what 
I don't even know what it's like. It has like a weird texture to it. it smells great and moisturizes it detangles lately i've finally been um really detangling my hair in the shower because i've not really been good with that in the past because i don't like to really wash my hair in the shower because i don't like getting the conditioner all over my body <laughs> but that's it for this one please make sure to like comment subscribe and share i'm gonna have a couple of giveaways going on in the near future so thanks again for watching please like comment and subscribe and share and i'll see you guys next time Bye.